my pasta and pizza is ready. Mm. Oh, I want to eat because of these games. I'm hungry! Hmm. I think Mary's screaming. This means that something interesting has happened. Yes. <laughs> what? Oh, who needs help? Oh. Granddaughter, don't shout. I'm already running. Hmm? Does someone need my help? I'm always ready to help anyone. Yes! Thank you for coming. I'm really hungry. So I suggest you start a culinary challenge on Rapapa. <laughs> for the first round, I want you to cook a donut for me. Wow, so beautiful. It'll be done. Hmm. Granny's always ready to please her granddaughter with sweets. Cooking a donut is very simple. You just need to put a piece of dough in a special machine. And in order to have a lot of donuts, then there should be more dough. Awesome! <sighs> I'll do the same. Only my donuts will be colored and bright. You're all kind of slow. Oh my. my donuts are already mm. done. Now it's time to dip them in red glaze. Just look at how pretty these donuts are. <laughs> and now, we'll come to the glaze. <gasps> all right, all right, all right. Look, it's just incredible this way. Now it's time to add some white glaze. It'll be even better this way. Hand, where are you? I need your help. Well done. Whoa. It's about time for my favorite strawberry syrup. We need to fill syringes. By the way, syringes cause an unreal reaction on others. Look. Rainbow, Granny. Look what I have. Why frighten me? I'm already an elderly woman. Granny, it's just what? syrup. Don't worry so much. Well, a little strawberry syrup will be bright on the donuts. It won't take syringes far away. With their help, you can decorate a portion of donuts okay. in an original way. Mary will definitely not like it. To decorate donuts, the most ordinary powdered sugar is just enough. <laughs> And my donuts are very beautiful without decoration. But it will be cool if I add a little more color sprinkles. It remains only to open this stupid what? jar. Come on! Ugh. Oh! What have you done? No offense, I didn't mean to, but now you're delicious too. I even have some donut sprinkles left. Mary, it's time to choose whose donuts taste better. All the donuts are so beautiful! Oh, but Wednesday did something oh. unusual. Very original decoration. What? Mmm, it's unrealistically delicious. And in addition, you can wash down donuts with strawberry syrup. Mm. Let's see what grandma has prepared. Some of your donuts are ordinary. I would like something more delicious, though. Okay. Okay. <gasps> oh, no! Oh. It remains to try Rainbow's donuts. Let's see. It's very tasty! Now I don't even know who to give the victory to. Rainbow or Wednesday. But still, Wednesday steamed up more. And her donut tastes better. I knew this. In the second round, I want you to cook pasta for me. It'll be done. I can cook noodles. Okay, I'll cook it. Well, it's time to start. First, you need to cook a portion of spaghetti. <laughs> it's time. But first, you need to find out if the water is hot enough. Won't do it myself. Why, if there is a hand? Get into the pot and check the water. Now I see that the water is ready. You can dip spaghetti in it. Let's do it. <laughs> But I don't want to use the purchase noodles. No. Hmm. All right, I'd rather all right, cook it myself. Right. Plus, I have everything I need. You need to start with flour. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh bless you. Thanks. I've almost filled all the flour. You need to break one egg into flour. Then turn this mixture into dough. This dough needs to be divided into small lumps. 
And each of them needs to be painted in different colors. Then I'll get colored spaghetti. Then, you need to stretch each lump. Let's do this. Then combine all the strips and cut them into the necessary pieces. Let's do this. I literally have a rainbow. Homemade noodles are always better. Look at that. Now we'll put some flour. And put it in the pot. It's ready to be cooked. <laughs> Even store-bought spaghetti can be made with love. Okay. Oh, this tea made my glasses fog up. I can hardly see anything. Am I pouring ketchup right? Oh, girl, help me. Granny, look out. Oh, I think I went a little overboard. <laughs> I like okay. Rainbow's idea to paint the pasta. But why make it colored? It's terrible. Hmm. Noodles should be black. Hand, help me. Let's do it the right way. I will use squid ink for that. Well, ta da! Let's shake it a little. Can't wait to find out. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Even ordinary ketchup will look much cooler on it. And you can complement the composition with the help of marmalade ice. Yeah. Wednesday wants to scare everyone again. My pasta is a completely different matter. It is bright and very cute. Mary will definitely like it. Wednesday! You've done something terrible again. I hope this pasta is at least delicious. Let's try. Ugh. Squid ink makes food disgusting. Just disgusting. Let's see what grandma has prepared. Nice. As a child, I loved her spaghetti most of all. Wow! It's very tasty! Awesome. <laughs> wow! Rainbow did her best, too! Let's see. And it turned out to be really good! This is the winner! Amazing! I'm a good fellow! Wow. Prepare a cocktail for me this time. I want something to drink. Wow. It'll be done. Yes. I'll make you a cocktail. Hmm. Of course, granddaughter. Hmm. You know me. I'll make the healthiest cocktail ever. You should definitely start with celery. After all, it is not for nothing that it is called one of the most useful products. It alone is quite enough for a delicious cocktail. I've already prepared mine. So let's pour it into a glass. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. And I'll make my cocktail based on toxic waste candies. They need to be distributed into molds, then shoved into the oven so that they turn into one big lollipop. So, let's do this. Mm, carefully. Perfect. And while the candies are melting, it's time to take a couple of selfies and eat a couple of candies yourself. Oh, ready. Now a lot of small candies have turned into one big one. So I got a delicious glass. Yes! Each of them will be filled with M&M's candies, which I'll distribute in advance by colors. <laughs> Let's open it. Pour it out. And sort it out. I'll put blue over here. Green and yellow. The sprite will be the basis of the cocktail. Oh! Forgot how soda can splash! Now it tastes like Sprite, but that's okay. The cocktail will not be spoiled in any way. Finally, I'll add some whipped cream and color sprinkles. Mm, so pretty. So, some sprinkles on top. And lollipops. <laughs> there are never too many of them. The last bit. Perfect! Nice. Oh my! Mm, finally. Now I can make a really delicious and beautiful cocktail. First, I'll decorate a glass with strawberry syrup. The basis of my cocktail will also be Sprite. But not give it a more interesting color. I'll drop some mint syrup into it. Hand, I need you again. Still rainbow cream right now. I need it too. What? <gasps> 
Well done. The cream will be the perfect support for the marmalade eye. And some more strawberry syrup. Mary, it's time to choose the winner. Wednesday, why are you making everything so creepy? It is simply impossible to look at this horror. Hope this is at least delicious. Yes! Mmm! It's actually very tasty. Putting a marmalade eye as a snack is just a brilliant idea. What? Mm. Grandma, did you make a sillier cocktail again? You know I can't stand it. I'm not gonna drink it. Let's go do Rainbow's cocktail. Wow! It's a brilliant idea! All right, all Rainbow, right, all right. you're winning an unconditional victory! Congratulations! My efforts were finally noticed! And prepare a salad for me! The Caesar one! Easy! Oh. <laughs> I can cook salads! Okay! Salad, good. For a good Caesar, you need to use fresh cabbage. It is the basis of this salad. Then you can add some chicken. It needs to be cut into small, small pieces. Let's cut it just like that. And put it on top of this salad. So, what kind of Caesar without tomatoes? They're also very important. It remains only to put some crackers on top. Perfect. The salad is almost ready. You just need to add the sauce and rub a little cheese on top. Oh, looks so good. Oh. And I'll do something original for Mary. She can eat ordinary salads anywhere, but I haven't seen edible vegetable flowers anywhere yet. <laughs> Rainbow, you're so good. I don't think Mary has ever received an edible bouquet as a gift. Something tells me that she will be very pleased. Wow! What a nightmare. Rainbow, it's not interesting at all. See how it should be. From ordinary pepper, I will teach you how to make a cute face. The base of the head is pepper. There will be lettuce leaves inside. I'll make a tongue out of cucumber. Next, the eyes. We will make our eyes out of olives. Let's put them on sticks and place them. You can decorate everything with tomatoes. And I'll make horns out of peppers. Mary, it's time to choose the winner. Rainbow, it's very beautiful. No one has really given me a vegetable bouquet yet. Let's try. Ugh, it's just vegetables. Grandma, but you heard me. I love your Caesar the most! You have a huge chance to win this round! Mmm, very tasty! I knew you'd like it! Mmm, yeah! Oh, Wednesday! What have you come up with this time? What a terrible head! Mmm, I can't stand olives! No, it's disgusting! Whatever. The victory in this round will go to Grandma! She made a really delicious Caesar. Oh, I knew I was going to win. 